Hey everybody, check it out. I just got this box in, shipped to Dave Williamson, or David Williamson, whatever. And check it out, this came from California. It cost $178 to get here, so you know there is good stuff in here, and that good stuff is Red Lines. Now, I some most of the time buy collections from private parties. This particular collection came from another collector, and that means the stuff in this box is really, really good. So sit back, relax, and watch as I unpack this entire box, show you every car in there for your red line watching pleasure. Thanks for joining me, Toy Car Collector, on YouTube. Here we go. All right, let's get this puppy open. It's gonna... Oh, yes, the anticipation is killing me. It's, whoops, I don't want to do that. I try not to do that. Let's get over here. I think I have the light all set up properly. You know, it's hard to cut boxes with one hand. Maybe I should use a tripod. What do you think? All right, hang on a sec. All right, I got the top of the box open, and let's see what's inside. Ah, collector carrying case. Ooh, this one is the 24 car, the highly desirable 24 car flat case with the dividers inside. That means there's 24 cars in there. I think there's 60 cars all together, but there may be more. I think, starting to think there is more. Oh man, this is heavy. 24. Oh by golly, there's another one in there. This one not as full. Those are going to clean up nice. Whoops. All right, and a otherwise mostly empty case. Okay, that makes sense. Anything else in there? No, get some packing peanuts. Okay, we're all set up now. Let's see, I think this case is empty, yes. Oh, look at that. And he put the trays in. I've never seen trays in sideways before. That's pretty cool. Anyway, pretty nice case. Got the label and everything on there. That's a nice one. I'll right, put that aside. Start with the first case here, the 24 case. Ooh, look at that. Oh, there's some sticker sheets in there. Sticker sheets and Hot Wheels. Move this off to the side. Let's see, how are we doing for background? Let's go down here, right there, okay? Let's go down there and see what we've got. First one up, a Volkswagen. Are we in focus? Come on out. Ooh, it's a lot of tissue here. Come on out. Oh, look at that. Nice Aqua Volkswagen. Are we going to have trouble focusing today? Come on now. Cooperate, Mr. Samsung. Looks pretty nice. Aqua, very clean. A little dust. I say very clean, meaning it uh, doesn't have any chips. I'm not seeing any chips. A little dusty. Could you just a little dust off. No problem there. We'll get that done. We'll get her done. Let's see. I've got this fabulous light on the side. Not sure where to put it. I put it behind? No. Put it in front? Possibly. Camera to the side. Let's try that. Very nice. Now look at that. No chips on that. So that's a nice Volkswagen. Next one up. Oh, a Johnny Lightning. That's right. This collection also features some Johnny Lightning models. One in particular I was digging was an orange GTO. Orange GTO. Now let's see here. This one is, is this the needle? No, this is the glasser. It's the glasser. It's supposed to have a little piece that goes on the front here, but that's okay. It doesn't really need that. Little black piece is missing. The color is very nice, though. That'll clean up nice. It's a green. I don't see too many green Johnny Lightnings. Not really. Not too many green Johnny Lightnings. Oh, wait a minute. What am I saying? There's the piece right there. There is the piece right there. It goes right on the front. Not that way. Like that to complete the look. Look at that. That completes the look. Right there. All right. Oh, another Johnny. Oh, no. This is a fire. There's, there's the Hot Wheels red lines, and then there's a variety of other things. And all Hot Wheels are Johnny Lightning related. And here we got a nice farb. A nice farb. Let's see. Is he complete? He's got his goggles. Looking pretty good. Yeah. I have already got one of these, so I now have an extra. That's always good. People are always looking for barbs. We'll put him in the back. 
Get some tissue in there. Uh-oh, look at that. Sadly, a broken divider. No problem, I've got extra dividers. All right, here we go, another Volkswagen. Oh, nope, this one, the Bug Bomb, the Bug Bomb. A beautiful ruby red, beautiful ruby red. Hmm, I think I might have too much light. Let's see, you know what? Let's scooch over here. I've got this side light, but I think I have better light over here. Got some overhead lights, real nice. Let's see if the camera can adjust to it. Oh, there we go. Look at that. With a white background, not so sure. Let's get that out of the way. And then we have the gray background. How's that? I think that looks better. Got your ruby red bug bomb. Very nice. I recently bought... I've been trying to figure out what size all the tires are on the Johnny Lightning, so I bought myself a caliper to measure them. I haven't done that yet, but I, I seem to always get the parts I need or the things I need to do a project, and then I don't get around to the project. But I do like acquiring the stuff to do a project. Oh, look at this beautiful, beautiful El Camino. Look at that. Beautiful lime color. Opening hood, opening doors. So pretty. Wow. That is a beauty. A beautiful Johnny Lightning Custom El Camino. Look at that. That's going to shine up so nice. Put that on my original Johnny Lightning store display. One of a kind. And the item, the thing that I got that made me decide to start making YouTube videos years ago. Many years ago now. Oh, look at this. Oh. Oh, Wilbur, that's so nice. That is beautiful. It's not a mirror, Johnny Lightning, but it's just very dang shiny. Super dang shiny. Look at that. Is that pretty? Yes. I had to stretch a little bit to buy this collection. You don't get cars like this cheap. Every once in a while, you get a private party. You get a good deal. <laughs> I got a tremendous deal the other day. If you go back and watch my video about the local collection. Did I post that yet? I think I did. I did I? I don't know. I better check. Oh, look at this one. Hot Rod. That is a gorgeous color on this hot rod. I'm not sure I've got any light colored hot rods. Most of them are red or aqua, but that's pretty. Like a lime color. Wow. Love it. I love that. Look at that. I think those are the same color. What do you think? No? This one's more yellow-like. Huh. That one's definitely a lime color. Orange. That's beautiful. I'm loving that. The Johnny Collection. Johnny Lightning Collection. Which I do need to thin down someday. It's hard to thin down your collection when you keep buying more and more and more. And you don't have time to thin down. Look at this. This is a very pale Mako Shark. No. Yeah, Mako Shark. Like an olive, but very pale. Very light. A very light spray. I'm going to say light spray. I don't think it was sun faded because it would be different on one side than the other. But right now it kind of looks gunmetal gray, but it's super cool with that white interior. So that's a nice addition to any Johnny Lightning collection. Let's see what we got here. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Ruby. Ruby, don't take your sand crab to town. There it is. Look at that. It's so pretty. Wow. These are nice cars. The fellow I got these from had uh, hand-selected every model for himself. And has decided. I think he needed the money to, to evacuate California. You know, it's about to fall into the ocean, I hear. Or something like that. Pretty weather there, that's for sure. Pretty weather. Pretty crowded. All right. Oh, look at that purple. Oh, my gosh. That's gorgeous. Purple Nucleon. Johnny Lightning. Beats them all. Well, Mattel beat them down. Beat them down to the ground. Out they went. Then again, I think they were run by the Mafia. You know, New Jersey and all that. Who knows? Who knows? Let's see. Johnny Lightning. I think this is a TNT. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. The colors are excellent. Lavender, TNT. Wow, look at that. Lavender, TNT. That's pretty. Probably should take it out of my hand so you don't have to look at my hand so much. Look at that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Zoom in. Zoom, zoom, zoom. 
That's pretty neat. Look at that. TNT. Gosh, can you imagine getting that as a kid? You'd be stoked. I'm stoked now. What else is in this case? Oh, there's some sticker sheets. Oh, they're not very good shape. Oh, but look at that. There's a snake too. A side sticker. That's cool. Whoops. You can't even see it. It's all fuzzy. Wish my phone had perfect fo focus. I thought it used to. Doesn't seem to now. And then one of these. A few decals left on that. Not too much. There's another one down in that thing. Get it out. Stuck down in the bottom of the case. Amazing what you'll find at the bottom of a case. Ah, look at that. It's another one of these in good shape. One thing you don't want to do, though, is you don't want to wipe this off with a wet cloth. <laughs> no, don't wipe off sticker sheets with a wet cloth. That is not a good idea. I've done it. I've done all the wrong things so many times. Now we've got another case to open. Away we go. Oh, my. You want to see? Look at this. Oh, yeah. That's what it... Oops. Zoom out. There we go. Look at that. All right. We've got buttons. we got parachutes. we got Hot Wheels. It's time to open them up and see what we got. Maybe I'll take these dividers out and get the cars out easier. Put some over here and here. I love I love these cases. It takes me a while to get them all cleaned up shiny like I like them, but they come out real nice. I usually have four or five of each case in my collection, and then when I get to a certain point, I'll sell one here or there. But there's oh. Well, look at this. We hit the gem of the collection right off the bat. Oh, look at that. Mm -mm -mm. 442. 442 with the original with the original spoiler, with the original stickers in beautiful condition. Look at that. Ooh, wow. Wow, that is so pretty. Let's just stare at that for a second. Stare. Stare. Uh oh, the camera's about to shut down. Gotta pause. All right, I'm still staring. It's beautiful. It's a beauty. Beautiful. I love 442s. All colors. My favorite casting. My first favorite, 442. My second favorite, class, classic chord. Oh my, you know these. Uh, I gotta save this one for later. I can't show you all the best cars right off the bat. There actually are like 60 cars, and only two of them are no big deal. The rest of them are all a big deal. Oh, like that. Oh, gosh. Come on. Come on. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Come on, camera. Come on. Work with me here. Work with me. Well, I'll stay out here then. That is so nice. Look at that. I've had a few of these. I passed them on because I didn't like them, but I do like this one. Barracuda. Got a little scuff right there. Barracuda. Look at how nice that is. Barracuda. Mm-hmm. Really, the only place you see cars like this for sale typically is at the convention, the annual Hot Wheels convention, which can't even take place right now. We're hoping L.A., but I don't think so. I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen. We're just going to be staying at home buying convention cars through the mail. And we're not going to get, oh, look at that 73 enamel, enamel show off. Look at that show off. Wow. Wow, we, wow, wow. That's a beauty. You ever tried to collect 73s? It is hard. 73s are terribly hard to collect because you put a few chips on them and they're just not as pretty. Look at this one. This one's beautiful. They all look like that. Look, my hands are shaking. You know what I spent the morning doing? First, I was cleaning the garage. Then the neighbors cut a tree down and left sawdust. Well, it wasn't the neighbors who cut it down. The tree guys left sawdust all over my car, road, everywhere. I had to go out, clean that up. And then I was like, you know, while I'm out here, I might as well dig out the water runoff. You know, the drain in the street. That was a lot of work with the shovel. Look at this. Look at this. What do we have here? What do we have here? We have a green barracuda. Green barracuda. It looks really nice. It looks so nice. I'm going to say this one almost looks like a repaint. I'm going to have to think about that, but I think this is correct with the little dots in the center of the rivets. What do you think? Is that the real deal? It seems too perfect to be a... A green Hong Kong car, but 
it is nice. You don't see them this nice very often. Hmm. Yeah. Perfect wheels. You're not going to, you can't make a perfect wheel. You can only have one. And the base is beautiful. The color's beautiful. Got a little darkening in the hood scoops. It is really, really nice. I think that's original. What do you think? Let's compare it to the blue. Gloss is fairly similar. It's funny to see a roof of a Barracuda Hong Kong without a bunch of toning on it, but there is some toning here along the edge there. And it is very even, very perfect. And um, what about those headlights? Looks like somebody might have dotted in the headlights. Maybe it's just the chrome dullness. I'd have to look at that with a magnifying, but it looks pretty good. It's pretty good. The rivets are different, but I don't think I don't think you could fake that. Oh, they, have, they both have the dots in the middle. This one has a dot there. Hmm, very nice. Very, very nice. Very, very, very nice. You know, barracudas are just so hard to get. So hard to get. Barracuda. This, oh, classic cord, of course. Oh, there's a lot of toilet paper in here. All right, classic cord. Let's take the roof off. A little dusty, but man, oh man, there's a little rub possibly right there, but no, I'm not seeing any major chips. Beautiful. It looks nice now, but with a little cleaning, it'll look perfect. Beautiful cords. I love cords. I love cords. Cords and 442s. I also love Camaros, Mustangs, Barracudas, Johnny Lightning, Matchbox. I love it all. That's why I've dedicated my life to collecting. Olive Mustang Hong Kong. Look at that. This thing is beautiful. I've seen pictures of it already. And it's beautiful. It has a few chips along the hood edge. But that's okay because it is so nice. These cars are really, really nice. The fellow who collected these got them a long time ago. Had access to some childhood collections back in the 90s when they were a little more common to find childhood collections. And we were buying them. We've always, collectors have always been looking for them. Oh, what's this? Oh, what is it? Oh, look at that. It's a 73 mongoose. Is that right? Mongoose? Yeah, snake is white. Mongoose is blue. Look at that. But it's so perfect. Oh, no. Well, yeah. Mongoose is blue, right? And it's a 69, 69. Well, come on now. Get open there. Yep. 69, 69. Right up underneath there. Can you see it? Probably not. Hard to focus on stuff like that. But it's very nice. Is it supposed to have the thing there? It's all right if it doesn't because I've got some of those. I've been saving for just times like this. Times like this. What's this? Oh, yellow charger. Hello. Hello, yellow charger. I don't even think I have a decent yellow charger. I really don't think I do. Now I do. Look, it's right here in my hand. See? I have a yellow charger right there. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, uh, uh. So beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. So beautiful. Yellow charger. Oh, my gosh. It's just brilliant. Brilliant. What's this? Oh, Nomad purple. Whoa. Look at the bling on that. Bling. Bling. Come on, bling. Come on, camera. Bling. Bling for me. There you go. Maybe my light is too bright. Hmm. I don't know. I do the best I can with what I have to work with. Look at that. Wow. I don't really want to get a different camera. It's too many things to learn. I'm tired of learning. I just want to have fun and play with Hot Wheels. Oh, look at that. Super fine turbine. Ta-da. Super fine turbine. This is uh, the only really good car in the lot that has some wear on it. But, you know, it's hard to find a super fine turbine, so that's okay. Got one already. Got a few. Uh, it would, I, you know, it would be so cool if these were shiny. I'd love to see these brand new in the baggage. 
brand new in the package. Let's go back in time. I'm waiting for a time machine. I think it's going to come too late, though. I don't think I'll be around when they finally figure that whole time machine out. So they'll have to go back and get me. All right, look at that. Heavy Chevy Chrome. Heavy Chevy Chrome, baby. Oh, yeah. That's the hardest one of the three. Heavy Chevy Chrome. Mm -mm -mm. Yum, yum. That's a beauty, too. Look at that. All original. All original. That is a sharp Chevy. Hmm. You know, it'd be cool. You could get us. Is this a 68 Camaro? You could get a 68 Camaro for real and have it wrapped in chrome. You could get a wrap. That'd be so cool. Somebody do that. That'd be great. Make a heavy Chevy chrome. Make all three club cars. If I win the lottery, I'm totally making three club cars. I totally am. I'm, Oh, look at that yellow beach bomb. Yellow beach bomb. This one's got a little wear on it too, a lot of toning, but it looks better with the bright light on it than if it was dark. Always shine bright lights on your Hot Wheels for the best look. Because you know how they are. They're Tony. Tony. Tony Hot Wheels. All right, we're almost to 20 minutes, which means I'm going to have to cut off and start a second video. Nobody's going to sit around for an hour, right? Here we got a 73 right there. Six strip teaser. Strip teaser. That's right. Fluorescent lime green. Can you say fluorescent lime green? Can you spell fluorescent? It's not easy. But there she is in all her stunning glory. It is a beautiful car. Imagine, imagine that thing. That's like a drag strip motor. So, all right, that is the end of part one of this fabulous collector's collection. And there may, there's going to be at least one more part, if not two. So, please check back in the videos. You know, you go back to my, click on Toy Car Collector there. And then check on the videos there. And you'll see the next video. And uh, thanks for joining me. And I uh, hope you love Red Lines as much as I do. And Johnny Lightnings. Don't forget about those. All right. See you on the next video.